Alright, as I was walking around town, I ran into this. That dude running into me. Aaron on the run. Hey, be careful. Can't barrel through a crowd like that. I... I'm sorry. I'm in a hurry. It's fine. What's the big rush? I have to go to the convenience store. The one over there. A real problem if you hit the convenience store that bad. Hey. Yes. I have to get some lip balm right away. Seriously? Yes. Lip balm. I'm in a hurry, so I have to run. Bye. Okay. I guess he has really dry lips. Ugh. What? Hey, what's up? Are you in some sort of pain? No. Oh, yeah. My feet are very sore ever since this morning. Why don't you just slow down a bit? Go easy on yourself. <sighs> Because if I don't run, I won't make it on time. in time. It's getting real cryptic. What do you mean? I'm sorry. I really have to get going. Bye. <sighs> Must be a real emergency on that kind of tear for lip balm. Maybe his lips are sandpaper or something. So yeah, welcome back to Yakuza 0. Uh, as I said before, we are going to be working on the Club Venus area along with... Uh, I believe we're doing our battle against Mercury. So I'll see you guys when I do some cabaret stuff. So I was making my way back around, uh, apparently there's this bathroom I can also interact with, but uh, we're gonna say no and come back to it later. Anyways, back to club stuff. Okay, now that we're back, we're gonna check out Club Venus. Alright, let's go sneak a peek at kind of hot us Club Venus. Good idea. Then let's... Ah, 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 ah. Where's the laugh coming from? What the crap? <laughs> it's me. And you are? Huh? What? Me? It's me. I have no idea who me is. Who are you? Huh? Wait, you don't remember me? You don't remember this beautiful face? Who the fuck are you? <laughs> Seriously, who are you? Huh? Hang on a sec. You really forgot? Huh? My name's Kanehara. Kanehara, owner of Club Venus. One of the five stars. Is that clear? Kanehara? Well, now that you mention it, it did look a little familiar. I knew who he was as soon as he walked in. Boy. Now you tell me. <laughs> so you really did manage to forget my face, huh? <laughs> that makes me sad. Your poor primitive brain. Really? Insult snail? Whatever. What's your business with Club Sunshine today? Kind of hot off the five stars. <laughs> a little birdie told me you guys were going to scoop out my club. Figured I'd be proactive and check you guys out first. And that little birdie was that? You want to cut to the chase and, or keep bullshitting me? <laughs> You're such an amateur, Majima kun. It's the very definition of amateur hour in here. My lady, your performance is at an end. Come back home to me. Yes, Kanehara sama. Oh no! She was faking it all along. What? Oh, well, job well done, my little spy. You already reserved us a room in a, at a nice hotel with a beautiful night view. Oh, I can't wait. Did you steal the things I asked for? Yes. Club Sanchez customer data, details on the girls, financial data. I got it all. Uh, tackle her and take it back? What? Wait a minute. Yora-chan? That can't be. Oishi san was a spy, but I thought. Uh, uh, you handed over the combination of information without a second thought. It's like taking candy from a baby. <laughs> We've got played like damn Samisens. <laughs> Shamisens. <laughs> you should have known if I do anything to pry the upper hand from my opponent. There's only way to keep winning this life or death game, Goro Majima. <laughs> Appreciate the lesson, Kanehara. <laughs> Such humility is rare in fools. Truly really know your place. Oishi kun. Can you take care of the data analysis after you get back? I want the juicy details on every weakness. You got it. Anything else in it for me? Mm. Well, that depends on what you find in that data, but how about I make a few calls and expand, extend that little hotel stay? It'll just be the two of us, of course. Pleasure. Man, she wants some of that action. <laughs> that was simple enough. Women are so amazingly foolish. <sighs> You're special kind of scumbag, ain't ya? Mm. 
I'll take that as a compliment. Speaking of scum, though, I must say, the city little club is quite fitting for you. A city exterior, city owner, everything here is so city, you can smell it in the air. Really? You should be under somewhat of my stature would think to even set foot in this club. Sure. Wanna try give it a rest with the lame insults? Yeah, can't believe you're so rude. <laughs> I don't know about Majima-san and the rest of the team, but I I am not city. <sighs> Come you get to be the only one that ain't city? Be because... Amazing. A jewel among the refuse. <laughs> what? Mm. What a beautiful woman. Yes, yes. You're talking about Ai-chan, right? I know how this goes. I'm not gonna have to fall for it this time. Yeah. No. It's you, my dear. What is your name? <laughs> what? You really mean it? Mean me? Uh, my name's Yuki. Huh? Yuki, say, you wanna be my lady? <laughs> what? I can pay you three times the peanuts you're earning here and grant you the priceless pleasure of sleeping with me. Think about it. Instead of wasting away in a dump like this, you could be living a life of luxury at my side. <sighs> no way. Huh? Hmm? What did you just say? <sighs> I said no way. You're not my type. For this thing from it actually so absolutely not absolutely not <laughs> what a tease i like you now i really need to make you mine huh you find a new girl to toy with ah chica and only moments after you manipulate another girl into doing your dirty work for you Oh, you mean the... Oh, you mean Oishi spying for me? Well, she might not be the sharpest tool in the shed, but she was the right tool for the job this time. Oh. Who's that? That's Chika-chan. She's the number one hostess at Club Venus. <sighs> Is she? She's a beauty. And no doubt she's got what it takes to turn earn that spot. Yeah. She has this mysterious air about her that just turns men into jelly. They say she's the one of the top girls in Sultan Body. Rumors that she's going out with Kanehara-san seem to be true as well. <sighs> You're really up and on the stuff like this, Ai-chan. Women are like pawns, Chika. That's important is to move them into the right positions to make sure they fulfill their potential. And when a girl has no value to you, you just throw them away without a second thought. But of course, and one day, I'll surpass sukiyama -kun with that strategy. Just you watch. Can let something as silly as sentiment, sentiment, sentiment get in the way of my ambition now, can I? Mm. I know. I just need to make sure I don't get thrown out too. <laughs> <laughs> you worry about things like that, Chica. I would never throw you away. That's so just a line being fed to you. As long as you're the number one girl in my club. Mm. I see. Well, I have to work harder then. Let's get out of here. You will be mine, Yuki. I promise. <laughs> I always get what I want, by any means necessary. Well then, ta-ta. Ugh. I just think I threw up a little in my mouth. Yuki-chan, you were such a big hit with him. You did it. <sighs> I'm not exactly happy about being hit on by that creep. That guy's more twisted than a pretzel. So, Kanehara and Chica from Clubina as well. At least things are staying interesting. Well, we ended up being checked out by Club Venus. Uh, well, let's do a cabaret club uh, thing. But first, we'll do a training session. We'll do another eye training session, actually. <laughs> Congratulations, Majima-san. You've top 4,000 fans from the Club Mercury area. Right on, Yoda-chan. Looks like the Club Mercury area will be sour soon. And that showdown with the old man, Misumura, is coming up even sooner. Yes, we have to stop Misumura. He's going down the wrong path. <gasps> Majima-kun, it's been a while. Well, it ain't Hibiki-chan from Club Mercury. What's up? I don't stock vinegar here. <laughs> I'm okay on vinegar. I found a shop the other day that sells a lot of it. Anyway, I will accept this. It's a challenge. We're finally going to have a cabaret club battle with the old man, huh? 
No hard feelings either, okay? Uh, right. No hard feelings. Have to get going. Bye, Majima-kun. Bye, wait. Hibiki-chan. Hey, can you tell me more about the store with the bin? She's gone already. I think Hibiki had you eating out of her hand. She's going to be a one tough opponent. We can't lose. Yeah, not sure why you're getting so worked up, though. But Yuki-chan says, Glimmerk is a powerful enemy. We have to take them on. We should make sure we sort our step lineup and get ready. Alright. Well, since I'm already here, I'm not gonna go for the battle right now. We're gonna do a special training. And we'll also start uh, working on Club Venus. Let's see. Can we do Ice Chance next training? Final customer service! Alright, Ai Chan. I think your customer service skills are in pretty good shape. Let's have our last talk. Last one? How exciting. <laughs> Majima, I haven't seen you in a while. Let's have fun. You're cheerful as ever. <laughs> You've been here at a cup for a while now. Are you all settled in? おかげさまで。こんな居心地が良くてみんな仲良く働いているお店は初めてです。前のお店ではナンバーワンでしたけど、その分他の同僚からは陰口叩かれてましたし、オーナーは私を人として扱ってませんでしたから。That is no fun. Now here yeah. Welcome to Sunshine Must Have Been Rough Winding Won't Help. Uh, this one's pretty obvious. <laughs> well, you made the right choice. Switching clubs. Welcome to Club Sunshine. Glad to hear it. And you know, we've got your back. If you ever need anything, just say the word. <laughs> Looking forward to it. Alright, good start. Hey, Ai chan. Is there anything about working here that bothers you? Eh, what is it? You tell me. These days are calling that sexual harassment. <laughs> uh, we should just defend her. Not on my watch. Kind of like that kind of crap doesn't fly here. You run into anyone who tries anything? I'll take care of him personally. Just flag me down. I mean, we don't even let it on our actual cabaret club. Bottom line is, like, I can come to a cabaret club and enjoy a co to enjoy a conversation with the beautiful lady. That's the product, not your bodies. <laughs> Only kind of cool. <laughs> Anything else on your mind about work? あんまり関係がないかもしれないのですが私マジマさんのことが気になりますなんちゃってえへへうん<笑> got a comedian nice one slipping that in there <笑><笑> all right I understand how you feel about the work but give me a rating now Anything I can do to improve my game? Anything you don't like? Hey, that's great. Makes me happy to hear it. So give me more. What's perfect about me, huh? Suddenly you're struggling. Classically ditzy. Oh man, <laughs> too many choices. We gotta we gotta play it confident because she was really going in, and then we kind of turned it on her. So let's keep it going. 
There's so many things perking about me. You can't pick one, eh? <laughs> Joking, of course. Uh, wow, I was joking, but if you're actually gonna believe it, what choice do I got? By the way, where are you originally from, Aichan? Gotcha. That means you probably know something about it pretty well by now. Got any restaurant or clubs you like to go to? Hmm. What's that? なんだか気持ちが安らいでくるんです。それに岩尾橋と違って、ナンパも少ないですし。Why <笑> ゆくそくですよ。あ、スイート。デイ。嬉しいな。好きな人と一緒にあそこでまったりするのが夢だったもんね。え?わざ Thank you for the lesson. <laughs> Perfect lesson. I was really having a good time there. Let's keep doing your best. Hello. Majima-san. Huh? What's up? So this is the end of our training together, right? Sure it is. Ai-chan, you're more than capable of working as a coastess without any more practice. It does make me happy, but I wish I could keep talking to you, Majima-san. Uh. Hey, no problem. You wanna go to Bishaman Bridge like I promised? <laughs> Oh, thank you. Let's go. Let's go. Huh. Nice. Well, it's not it's not night time, but the first fret. It is surprisingly lo lonesome. <gasps> ah, this place is so nice. I feel like I can relax here, huh. just standing in the middle of the bridge. Could I agree. Ain't got great memories of this town, but I do like the view from the Bishamon Bridge. Oh, really? I really like it here too. And this time, I'm with here with you, Majima-san. Just the two of us. <laughs> that makes you happy? Hi. Oh yes, I'm really happy. I can't remember the last time I got to walk around with someone. That's so. Now you mention it though, I do remember yes saying you don't get go out with friends for too often. Hi. Yeah, I don't really make friends with the bullies back at school, and I haven't been in Osaka long. So I haven't had many chances to make friends here either. Yeah? That's a real bummer, but the way you're going now, Aichan, you'll be making more friends than you can count in no time flat. <laughs> you really mean that? Thank you. Besides, Aichan, I think everyone at Sunshine already considers you a friend. <laughs> really? You you think so? I would love it if that were true. I mean, you're pretty close to Yuki, right? You know, I think Sunshine is a really strong club. <laughs> you think so? I feel like we got a ways to go before we're in the same tier as those TF tier clubs, even though my rank is already at the highest it can be, probably. Mm -hmm. Oh no, I know that. That's not what I meant. I was talking about the club's attitude. Mm -hmm. It's attitude. Uh -huh. Yes. When I was bullied in school, all I ever did was run away. But the people of Sunshine don't buckle down under pressure. Even when the other clubs try to cause trouble, Sunshine is always up to the challenge. That's a... That's real strength. That, that's why I don't think I need to run from trouble anymore. Sunshine has changed me for the better. <laughs> yeah. That's how I don't do that to you, for you, I hear. Can't predict the future. But as long as we stick together, we'll make it through. Whatever the world, the world throws our way, right? Yes, of course. Let's do our best together. <laughs> that's the spirit, Aichan. Shine when you're cheerful, alright? 
We should get going. Oh, she's gonna do it? Hmm? Something wrong? Uh, Ma Majima-san, before we go, can I ask you one last question? Sure, what? Ma Majima-san, have you have this image of being all business, but I was wondering, would you ever consider going out with a girl? Going out with a girl, huh? Hmm. The right one came along is probably what she wants to hear, because we don't want to disappoint her, right? Sure, work's important, but if the right girl comes along, I might consider going out with her. Eh? Oh, really? You would do that? I I'm kind of surprised. Good to know there's a chance. Yeah. Huh? Uh, uh, no, uh, it's nothing. It, uh, it, it's getting chilly. Should we get going? Huh. Yeah. We should go. Alright, Chan. I'm counting on you. Hi. Ugh. Why is she super smiley now? I'm counting on you too, Majima-san. As a friend, I think they, they should have maybe lowered her upper lip just a tad to make that smile not as creepy. Absolutely. It's an honor to have you as your first one of those. Now, you can't go around saying you got none either. <laughs> okay, thank you very much, Majima-san. Your advice and friendship mean everything to me. Well, that's nice. I sub story complete. One level. Well, since we're already here and everyone's looking good to go, we might as well do this rival battle. I think we're ready. Should have saved, but it's whatever. Majima, Yoda, been a while. Hi. Misumura-san, I'm going to stop you. Yoda, you're just like I used to be a long time ago. <sighs> I hope your youthful enthusiasm won't be your undoing. <laughs> Yoda-chan is really fired up for a change. There's no way we can lose with him flipping out like that. Yes. Well, I can't lose either. I have a promise to keep. Promise, eh? Nothing you should concern yourself with either way. It's the end of the road for you. <laughs> <laughs> now, we get to see Misumura-san when he really means business. They used to call him the line of the cabaret, you know. I'm looking forward to this. Sorry, old man. There ain't no way we're stopping here. Let's start this up. Club Sunshine's open for Hi. business. Yes. Can the old man do a scowl? He has a ponytail like us. Not quite. Majima's always gonna win that scowl battle, battle though, so... Uh, what do we got here? Wealthy right off the bat, sweet. Uh, we'll give him I. Another one coming in. Another wealthy guy. Uh, we'll give him Saki. Average. We'll try to give him someone lower. Uh, let's give him Etsuko. Dang, we're getting the seats filled in real fast. Wealthy guy. Uh, I'm gonna try to save Yuki, so we'll give um, Shizuka. She's pretty good overall. <laughs> It's glass. Easy money. Yeah, yeah. Alright. Another wealthy guy. Oh, we have to give him Yuki this time. <laughs> Performance decreased. Rival sales are up. Ah, he reduced the... We need a towel there. So they reduced our happy faces to average. That's not great, but we can work with it. Another average guy. Well, Dolly it is. Uh, ladies glass. Ice. Alright, all our platinum girls are doing good. Hopefully we can get our other wealthy person to get happy. Hey, 
なおこちらになります私はそれを見つけたら、ありがとうございます。Alright, we got three of our wealthy guys happy. That's good enough for me. Average guy.、Uh, we'll give him Junko, I guess. Alright, this is what I want to see. Towel, there we go. We'll try to extend his session once he's done. We're slightly ahead right now. Alright, we'll praise our girls here. Recover their health a bit. Alright, we're sitting pretty. Our platinums are good. That poor guy. Well, we'll give him Mitsuko. Let's see, come on, give me another wealthy guy or maybe even mega rich. Wealthy, good enough.、Uh, we'll give him、um, Saki. Let's see, can we extend the session here though? Nope, alright, fine, fine. Another wealthy guy. Uh, we'll give him Shizuka. Guess glass. Alright,、okay, we still got a full minute left, so we can still potentially get some.、Uh... Ooh, she's really low on health. We have to let her rest a bit. Another wealthy guy. Uh, let's give him I. Another guest class. Everyone wants some more drinks. Just guzzling down that alcohol. The poor guy. I'm just gonna give him Namiko. He hasn't done anything this, this、uh, club battle anyway, so. Up ashtray, sweet. That was an easy one. The only bad thing is that this guy's a poor. Bad session. Guess glass again. How many drinks is this guy having? Alright, I only did that to increase the happiness. Extend session? Nope. I should have just said thank you for that guy, but it's fine. We made space, and the poor guy is.、Uh, at least one of them is about to leave. Average guy.、Uh, let's give him Shizuka. Alright, 30 seconds left, so this is probably the last guy that will matter. Old lady pulling her weight though. Another average guy? Well,、uh, yeah, just go back in there, old lady. Another wealthy guy. Yeah, we'll give him to Saki. Alright. Pretty sure we've pretty much destroyed this guy. But man, these guys are asking for help over and over again. The poor guy will just give you、uh, Junko. Ice. 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 
Alright, seven seconds. This one's pretty much done. I'm pretty sure I won. That doesn't matter, dude. You can't do anything. Two more guests than us, but... Oh, we lost! Wow! By just a tad. So what happens? Let's find out. Did we lose fans? <laughs> Looks like I won. Damn it. We lost. Our reputation just got shot. You can't leave an island and leave us alone, Yuda. You need to learn that. <laughs> Even if you're right, Mr. I'm not ready to give up where I think it's right. I see. Then I have to take you on again. I'll see you later. <laughs> oh, I see Muda. Wait. Let's rebuild and challenge them again. Uh. Yeah. Let's see. So, the shift from time being taken from your opponent. That's okay. Anyways, I'll see you guys when I win that battle, so give me a bit. Well, since we have the chance, uh, I'm gonna do Saki's customer service number one, and then I'll meet you guys when I finish the battle. Alright, you ready to talk, Saki? Of course, let's do it. Remember, for your customer, might be difficult, but I'll manage. Hello, I'm Saki. Let's have a great time today. Got an open, direct way of talking, I like it. Can you tell me something about yourself? What do you do on your days off? Sleeping. That's pretty health conscious of ya. Did you play sports as a kid or something? Ah, a sporty girl. Nailed it. Guess there's a reason they called you Busy Visaki at Club Jupiter, isn't there? I've never been able to play tennis very well at all. <laughs> That's amazing. Must really like exercise, Saki-chan. Nah, they're fucking cool. <laughs> Ain't wrong, not, nothing wrong with sporty hobbies, I think they're cool. Who the hell cares, but I guess this is the 80s in Japan. Mm. Yeah, well, screw them. Not many girls in our industry are into that, so it makes you unique, Saki-chan. You gotta be proud of that. Yes, <laughs> So, you have any other hobbies? Hey, cooking. That sounds pretty domestic. May that be the subject you wouldn't feel bad about bringing up? Yeah, not very good at it. What's the matter? Nothing scores more points than being a good cook. What's your specialty? I have no idea what karage is, so I'll just say I love karage. Love karage. Chicken's good. Fried chicken's but Ah, okay, so that's what they call... Well, it, it must be a special way to cook chicken, but it's fried. Okay. Why would I laugh at you being able to make food? No way! This is a technique to frying chicken, right? Flavor, temperature of both the oil, the uh... uh... I mean, that's very proactive of you. <laughs> Ain't nothing wrong with that. Heck, bring me some of that fried chicken goodness next time you make it. 
Oh, she's nice. So, now that I get to know you a little, now that I got to know you a little better, Saku-chan. Go for it. Sorry. What are we asking? Let's see. Do you got any talents? I mean, she did say she took care of her brothers, handling kids. Makes sense. Well, can I be your bro? Eh. You make a good mom is probably what she wants to hear. I don't think she wants to talk about a business. A good quality to have. You'll make a great mom someday. <laughs> I know how you feel. Can't even imagine having a family. Suppose we can find a good... We gotta find a good partner first. Hey, I'm only 24, Saki-chan. You gotta don't you don't gotta act that surprised. I mean he definitely does look older than 24, but anyways. So, let's flip the script. How about a weakness? Insects. I mean I'm pretty sure most girls are not into insects. Damn with authority. What kind of bugs give you the shivers? どんな虫って虫はほぼ無理ですよ。見るのも嫌。うん。いや、でもだまちゃん。はい。中でもよく台所に出る黒いあれ。私。We talking roaches? I'll fucking squash it. <laughs> hey, I can swing by with the shoe of death if you want. Are you sure? Ah, uh, sorry. Wouldn't be quite proper of me showing up at a girl's house now, would it? <laughs> Seem awfully happy about that. Well, you just call Goro the Exterminator, Majima, if you see one, okay? Well, that went pretty well. Alrighty, let's save a color of day. Thank you, Majima san. Perfect lesson. I'm glad you had fun. Thank you. I feel really confident now. Keep it up. One level. Alright, I'll see you guys. Alright, I kicked his ass this time just because I got lucky and I got like three mega rich guys right off the bat, so that really helped my sales. Yeah, if I had like a mega rich guy last time, I would have probably won that one. I literally only lost like by 50,000, I think. Not even like 100,000. And also, I'll mention this real quick. You have a slightly different dialogue right off the beginning, but not by much. Anyways, we won. Also, it helped that I used some of my lower level ones, um, because that lowered my cost of my staff. Only a little bit. The sales made up way more for it anyways, but if I had slightly lower staff cost, I think I would have won as well. Alright, so we finished up Jupiter area. I mean, Mercury area. Ugh. We won. <laughs> Yeah, we did it, Yoda Shan. Yes! At last, you've done well, Yoda. Splendid. After all, none of my apprentices ever surpassed you. Misamura san, I'm glad it was you that I lost to. I can shut down my club with no regrets. You, you don't have to do that, Misamura san. We can still start over. We can do this the right way, together. <sighs> Yoda, it's not possible. I've gone too far down a different path. <sighs> but. After I lost my wife, 
I used every dirty trick in the book to protect the club. As long as I was alive, I would keep the club going. That's the promise I made to her before she died. A promise. I I'd heard about your wife's passing, but I had no idea you'd make a promise like that. It was difficult for an old man like me to run that cabaret without any help. <sighs> it went downhill quick. And pretty soon, I was in danger of going out of business. That's when Tsukiyama appeared on the scene. Business was good. As long as I did what the man said. <sighs> Whether it was converting the club from a cabaret to a club, to a cabaret club, or ripping off customers, I did everything he told me to. I looked past all of that because I knew that's how the club was staying open. I basically sold my soul to the devil. But this is the end of the road for Club Mercury. It's time. It was quite... It was time quite a while ago, in fact. I don't know when it will be, but when I go to heaven, I'll tell my wife. I'll tell her I'm sorry. <sighs> it's a san I had no idea. I didn't know I, I said all those things to you. Yoda, don't ever lose your honesty. You, remind, you really remind me of myself back in the day. With you around, I'm confident the future of Sultan Bodhi's entertainment district is in good hands. Misumura-san. Majima, I think that you're capable to, of doing too, and I have to ask you a favor. What is it? After Club America is gone, would you let Hibiki work at your club? Huh? I know she's a little weaker than some girls, and that she can't work, come to work into work every day. Most girls wouldn't put up with that for very long. Her club seems like the type that would actually want her welcome her for the talent she does have, would you? <laughs> <laughs> of course. Any girl you train would be welcome in addition to other team. That's great. Thank you. Misumura-san. Hibiki, thank you for everything you've done for me. Take care of your younger brother and mother. Family is everything. Uh, thank you, Misumura-san. <laughs> well then, it's time for this old soldier to turn his combat. But Turn in his combat boots. We may not see each other again. See you later, old man. Misumura-san! Thank you very much. Do your best, Yoda. Hi. I will! And he's gone. Guess Grant was pretty cool. Hey. Yes, I really looked up to him. Hello. Majima-kun, thank you for everything. I'm looking forward to working with you. Ah. Yeah, I am too. Counting on you, Hibiki-chan. <laughs> you can count on me. <laughs> yes, new platinum. That does mean we have to juggle again two girls with their training. Ah. Right. Uh, yeah, sure. Why are you ogling her? I ain't. You are too. I'm not. Oy. That's enough flirting, you two. Get a grip and let's get serious here. The five stars are still out there. Wait, did I just get a scolding from Yoda-chan? Well, that was humiliating. You watch, Misimura-san. I'll be the one to carry your legacy forward. <sighs> oh, we should always work this hard. Don't worry. I'll be back to his old self tomorrow. <laughs> Majima-san, everyone else. Let's get ready for next shift. Let's go. <laughs> Alright, let's do this. So even Musimura-san has fallen. This old man... He was an old man who was behind the times. All they did was kick out his crutches. Kotomi? I assume there are already plans in place to deal with him? Of course. What kind of assistant would I be if I waited until you asked to take care of ma these matters? Remarkable as always. Goromajima of Club Sunshine. Looking forward to seeing how you handle the challenges that await you. We've unlocked more blocks from Breaker Style. Or the block from Breaker Style, actually. Also, oh no, the old man's gonna get assassinated. <laughs> and we get a billion gen. Well, I'll see you guys when I do a scene for the Club Venus stuff. I'll be right back. Alright, so... We're gonna throw in a Hibiki customer service section. Just because we're gonna probably do Club Venus, uh, Venus fairly soon, so I'm gonna try to get Hibiki up to speed because we're gonna get another Platinum Girl at that point, and I'm gonna have to juggle three of them, so let's get started on our newest one. So let's get to know Hibiki. Alright, ready to start your training? Sure. I'm looking forward to it, Majima-kun. Right on. That sounds like fun. I'll do my best. Here we go. 
She has a bit of a softer look compared to the other ones. Let's start off easy. Where are you good at? What makes you special? That's right. You're taking care of your younger brother instead of your parents. How old is the little guy now? Hmm. Interesting. She must be a quite a bit older than if she's working here and he's seven. Yeah, sounds about right for that age. I notice she has a lot of pauses. Hmm, this one's tough because you obviously don't want to do corporal punishment. That that always ends up bad. So it's either X or B. She's wondering if she's spoiling him too much. So I think maybe we should go with X on this one. Sounds like you just gotta crack down on the kids. Kind of an easy going. You're kind of easy going, Hibiki chan. So maybe you're handling him with kid gloves? Mm. I mean, sh you shouldn't be afraid of that. Like, eventually they'll learn that it's trying to do a balance. If you just give in to everything a kid does, they'll just grow up worse over time. Nah, any hate in that situation is passing thing. Plus, even if he hates you now, there'll come a time in the future where he figures I was for his own good. So yeah, that, that's exactly what I mean. <laughs> Takes courage, but discipline's important. Got it. Oh, you know it. Alright, if kids are your specialty, what are your hobby? What's your hobby, Hibiki-chan? Hmm, I wouldn't say walking's a hobby, but... Walking? What do you mean? Everyone walks, yeah. Walking is... まあ、お散歩みたいなものね。私、昔から病弱でお医者さんから激しい運動はしたらダメって言われてきたの。Yeah, the old man mentioned that, so I wonder why she even gets sick a lot. でも、この仕事は体力も必要だし、軽いウォーキングくらいなら大丈夫かなって思ってね。I mean, that's not a bad idea, but I still wouldn't consider it a hobby. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I read, yeah. She's definitely worried that that she's uh, not enough, so we gotta give her some positive reinforcement. You're amazing. You're really serious about working, Hibichi chan. Keep it up and try to get stronger. <laughs> Yeah, she feels like you should burn him. Huh? Oh no. I didn't mean it that way. Yeah, that's good. Don't go killing yourself over me. Hmm, so I guess we should have done the other one. Oh well. Let's see. What to ask you next? Here we go. Did you have any dreams when you were a kid? Ah. Manga artist. Wasn't expecting that one. Hmm. Now this one's a little tricky, 
She already kind of told us that she always liked to draw, so I feel like B is not really the one we should pick. But I don't want to make her sad by asking why she gave up. But let's ask her what kind of manga, I guess. Hmm? What kind of manga do you like? <laughs> I guess right on that one. But, uh, yeah, you're never too old to do something you used to enjoy. Look at me, I'm playing video games. <laughs> so you're just a little girl at heart, Hibiki-chan. Which mecha manga is thrilling you these days? Uh. Sounds oddly specific. Mm. Workplace romance, eh? That's something I have the luxury of thinking about, but I guess it could be exciting. I'm sure she means it even a little bit. <laughs> Lines like that make me see how you can get the customers eating right out of your hands. You're good. Alrighty, got any weaknesses, you know, of Hibiki-chan, besides the obvious one you're gonna probably mention anyways? Huh. I gotcha, you certainly are mild-mannered, Hibiki-chan. You're, shall we say, serene. Hmm. Now this is a similar choice to the second one. But I don't... F <laughs> Here's the thing though. Isn't she like sickly? So I don't want to encourage her to drink alcohol if she gets like sick and stuff, but... I guess we're gonna... maybe... I, I don't know. We'll go with B, I guess. Sounds like alcohol to the rescue. It's a powerful tool, you know? To help lighten things, lighten the mood. Ah, there we go. Yeah. Hmm? This sounds like a harm ranger of a story. Do go on. Uh-oh. <laughs> Holy mother. I mean, that sounds exciting, but yeah. Let's keep you off the sauce. Alright, I should have gone with my gut instinct instead of the other one. Oh well. It's a normal lesson. Thanks for the lesson. Let's see. Decent lesson, yeah. Alright, so we'll skip the dialogue. Anyways, I'm gonna do a cabaret club, and I think I should reach enough to get to the second portion of the club Venus stuff. So I'll be right back. After we check how many levels we got. Just one. Alright. <laughs> Kujiji Legends Majima-san, we now have 3,000 fans from the club Venus area. Oh, nice. We're making good progress. Yeah. I bet Kanehara hears that news, it'll wipe a smile off his face. Sure hope so. Ah, 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 ah. Gotta laugh like Ganondorf when that happens, I think. That <laughs> <Not> laugh. <laughs> it's me. Kanehara. <laughs> Look at that. You finally managed to remember my name. I'm so happy. <sighs> what do you want? Making a stop at to drop a declaration of war or something? Huh? Me? Against you? How quaint. Raiders don't declare war on their prey. They just eat them. I simply came to see Yuki. What? Me? Yuki, are you ready to become my lady? What are you talking about? <laughs> you know exactly what I'm talking about. There have been a woman who refused me. Come, this is the beginning of our grand adventure together. <sighs> Knock it off. <sighs> I'm never going to like you. Just leave me alone. <laughs> <laughs> I see. You're cute, Yuki. Never been denied like this in my life. This is so amusing as it is novel. Maybe I already s said this already, but I don't stop until I get what I want. That's not how you do things, guys. If I can't have it, I'll make sure no one else can. 
Especially... Not that. Huh? I don't wanna... I don't want you to be unhappy, Yuki. Why do you live in my arms? You really should stop teasing me so much, you know? I'd be very sad if you weren't here. Well, ta-ta, Club Sunshine. I look forward to your continued, albeit futile, efforts. What an asshole. What? Hey, Yuki-chan. You okay? Hi. I'm fine. I... I won't let him intimidate, intimidate me. Good to hear. Besides, you'll protect me if anything happened, right? Uh. You know it. I got your back. Hi. Me too. And me there. Me three. I'll be your bodyguard, Yuki-chan. <laughs> <laughs> this is great. Thank you, everybody. She's worried, though. Okay, this boy's still trembling. But he's trying to, her best to be brave. This means I gotta stop kind of hot if we're having his way. Hmm. I wonder what would happen. I get the feeling something's not gonna end up right. Anyways, I'll see you guys when something else happens. <laughs> Congratulations, Majima-san. We've top 5,000 fans from the Club Venus area. Good job, Yoda-chan. Club Venus ain't gonna be able to ignore us after this. Aye. Yes, I'm sure host one of you will be here soon to challenge us. <gasps> Excuse me. Wait, ain't you Chica from Club Venus? What you want? I have a message from Kanehara. Here. We can do the challenge. Challenge to Cabaret Club Battle. We ain't gonna get easy on ya. Uh, yeah, yeah. Mm. Um, is Yuki-san here? Yuki-chan? Hi. Yes? What can I do for you? Yuki-san, please don't take this personally, but if I were you, I'd get out of here as soon as you can. Mm? What? What does that mean? A man I know too w uh, know well has been acting a little strange lately. And, I don't know, I just feel, have a really bad feeling. Mm. I think he may be plotting to kidnap you, Yuki-san. Please, you have to be careful. When you say he, you don't mean... Hey, what's with the big idea? I'm trying to scare Yuki-chan. Trying to throw her off her game so you can get the leg up on the cabaret club battle? That it? Majima-san. Mm -hmm. No, it's not it at all. He really will do anything to get what he wants. He's a dangerous man. Mm -hmm. I don't want to see any more girls hurt by him, that's all. If Kanehara catches you... You're gonna have to bat you're gonna have a bad time. So Yuki some please. Go somewhere safe for now. Mm -hmm. uh, I won't be intimidated like that. I'm a member of Club Sunshine. I'm gonna fight beside Majima San, Yoda Chan, San and Ai Chan. And not the other girls that are here but we don't mention. I mean, I know I'm still an amateur, I might not have much to contribute, but that doesn't mean I'm gonna run away. Yuki Chan. Besides, everyone here has my back. I'm not afraid of Kanehara. <sighs> I see. I wish you'd believe me, but please be careful. Grooming someone from the equation comes all too easily for him. Oh, Chika-san. Chika-san. I wonder if she was really worried about me. If she actually meant it, then I was pretty rude to her. Well, who knows. Maybe Kanehara told her to say those things to scare you. Aisha's kind of like waving at us. Well, no soon enough. Looks like we're going up against Kanehara any day now. Yes, you're right. Mm. But she always was so always so calm before. And she seemed almost desperate to warn me. What is Kanehara up to? Uh. Well, there's never any harm being more careful. You watch yourself, Yuki-chan. Hey. Okay. Oh, and Yuki? You were pretty cool back there. Come a long yeah. way. What? R really? <laughs> <laughs> really? Who laughs like that? Don't do that. Oh. Hey, Yuki. Quit laughing like a cartoon and come help me with this. Hi. Oh, sure. Kanehara, what are you really up to? Well... Mm. Bleh. I can't believe Yoda-san would send me out to fetch vinegar. What a pain in the butt. I'm gonna assume she's gonna be in trouble. Are, are you Yuki-san from Club Sunshine? Mm -hmm. Huh? Uh-oh. Oh, Majima-san. Have you seen Yuki-chan? Yuki-chan? No. I see. That's strange. She went out for some errands, but she hasn't come back yet. I wonder if she stopped by somewhere? Yuki-san loves desserts, so maybe she's having a snack somewhere. A 
this be how it's doing? No, it can't be. Let's give her a little more time. Hi. Agreed. We'll have to make do with the other stabber until she comes back. <sighs> but I'm worried, though. We'll be all get going up against Clubina soon. Yuki has gone missing. She will not be able to be in the roster until she returns, which probably means I have to beat Club Venus without Yuki, which is kind of rough. So I'm going to make sure my uh, my other Platinum girls are up to speed, and I'll see you guys when I actually start that battle. Okay, we're going to do the rival battle, so we don't have Yuki for this one, which could prove difficult, but at least my other Platinums are pretty solid, particularly I. And we also have... Um, Dolly here, who's pretty solid for... She's almost a round, all rounder. She doesn't have party, but that's okay. We mostly want talk, love, and HP primarily. I am bringing Hibiki even because she has a lot of that stat except for HP. Also, I did give uh, Hibichi a makeover, but actually, funnily enough, uh, I kept her in her basic dress. I just gave her some extra accessories, and she ended up being pretty good without having to change her dress, unlike the other three I've had so far. Saki looks so goofy, but it works. <laughs> she actually has the same setup as I, and I is wearing the sunglasses indoors, which is eh. At least Yuki just looks nice without any extra stuff. But anyways, let's go do the rival battle for Club Venus. Ah, 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 ah. That laugh again. Boy. There you are, Majima-kun. Looks like you're working pretty hard in your seedy little club. How are you doing? Can't complain, I guess. How about you? Club's losing fans, but you look like you're doing okay. <laughs> <laughs> no thanks to you. But now that I look at you, I have to say, you look a little concerned. Is something the matter? Mm. Mm, it's almost as if one of the girls in your club has gone missing. Way to make it obvious. <laughs> you, what have you done with Yuki-chan? <laughs> Now, now, Majibakun, I have no idea what you're talking about. I told you before, didn't I? I always get what I want. Huh? You son of a... Timing's almost most unfortunate, isn't it? Based on our analysis, it seems that Yuki is your club's main girl. With its main attraction out of the picture, what hope does the club's sunshine have of winning against us? <sighs> God. You know, we could always postpone the battle until later. If you get down on your knees and beg for it, how about it? Damn it. How slimy can this pawn scum get? What should we do, Majima-san? We're at a real disadvantage without Yuki. No. Let's do the battle, Majima-san. What? Sure. It'll be tough without Yuki-chan here. <laughs> but with all of us working together, we'll be able to handle a whistle like this. Besides, if Yuki-chan were in my, our shoes, I bet she'd want to stick around and fight. Aicha, no. caving to a man like this won't do anyone any good. Majima-san, let's do this. Let's win and get Yuki-chan back. Uh. All right, yeah. <laughs> Quite an inspirational little speech. I'm fired up. Shall we start the cabaret club battle then? It's showtime. Well, I'm really sure this guy won't do a good scowl. Sure. Eh, not too bad. Well, also, I've noticed in some of these battles, I'm uh, not battles, but just... Alright, so we got a wealthy guy right away. He wants talk, he wants something else. We'll give him Dolly, she's solid at this. But as I was saying, sometimes the mega rich guys want a specific platinum girl, so... Alright, poor guy. Hopefully we can make him happy with... Yeah, we can make him happy with anyone. So, let's throw in one of our silvers, maybe. Arumi or Shiho? Actually, let's give him Seiko because she's a gold, but she's our lowest stat one. If I need something a little bit of, like for an average guy, we'll give him a silver. They left through interference. And rival sales are up, HP is down. Uh, we'll give this guy, this girl. Okay, so they left. That's unfortunate. That was a wealthy guy in that. An average guy. Uh, let's give him Siho. Shiho. 
I'll swap you out. Can I make you happier? No, I don't want to give you a platinum. Never mind. Another wealthy guy. Can't make him happy with Shizuka or Dolly. We'll give it to Dolly. Alright, time to make you even happier. Towel. Ashtray. <laughs> Wealthy guy again. Alright, we have to give him a platinum, but we'll give him Hibiki since she's our lowest one. Alright, we need some mega wealthy guys. I'm not doing too hot on this one. He just wants love, luckily, so Aichan can cover that real easy. Do you want to extend your session, sir? Yes! Give me that. Okay, we have another wealthy guy. We give him platinum. Wait for that sit-down animation to finish. We'll make this guy extra happy. You want ice. I can't wait for a level 2, so we're just gonna go for a level 1. Alright, we got two wealthy guys happy. Unfortunately, I did not get my mega rich guy on that. Ashtray. If we're lucky, come on. Ah, I didn't get the rich guy, but I got the mega wealthy. That's, that's the one we really want. Fortunately, we might lose this guy if he activates his thing. Yeah, we lost this guy, but that's okay. We, we, we kept everyone else. Alright, praise the girl. Recover health, please. So he wasted most of it. We would have lost four guests, but we only lost one. It's unfortunate that one of them was wealthy, but I think we're on track now. Wealthy guy's back. Uh, we'll give him Saki just to make sure he's happy. We get a mega wealthy that wants somebody specific, we'll trade out, but... Praise Dolly, she's in bad shape. Wealthy guy wants to talk. Uh, we'll give him Harumi because Dolly's a little bit too low health to last. Still got a full minute left. We got another guy coming in. Come on. Alright, check please. So, you know, maybe giving her a gift, but that's okay. He just wants love. Oh, that's not good. None of these will help out. Can we trade out you? Yes, I can. It's better than what it was, so it's whatever. Yeah, eye is in bad shape, but we can pull through. We can trade out for eye now. We trade for Saki there. <laughs> All right, we got the mega rich on that. That's the main thing that matters. Another mega rich. Dolly will have to do for now. We're gonna probably lose these three guys, unfortunately. Oh, we can make it happen with Shizuka there. Guest glass. We're gonna lose for sure all our guests that are not in fever. If we're lucky though, I might be able to get something going. Towel. Probably not gonna get my fever before this guy uses his level 3. Unless I'm really lucky. Now oh, there it goes. Yeah, there they go. It's fine. We got Omega Rich still dropping the big bucks for us, so. Uh, we'll give him Shizuka. He does need to last for a little bit longer. Wealthy guy, we'll give him... Saki. As soon as she sits down, we'll trigger our fever. Uh, 
Alright, just give me money. Can't do anything about that. Alright. Did we win though? It was iffy. Nice, we did it. We did way better against this guy than against the old man. The old man actually beat me the first time. Anyways, we did it. So Harumi is already max level. So our silvers are max level at, uh, I'm assuming it's like 30 maybe? And platinums are probably 40s or 50s. Anyways, we'll find out soon enough. Yeah, get fucked. How could I possibly lose to these losers? Me? <laughs> and Club Such and ain't even warmed up yet. Had enough? <laughs> yes, this always prevails. Inconceivable. Huh? No. No, no, no. No! <laughs> I wasn't supposed to lose. I was supposed to win. I haven't taken I haven't taken them down yet. <laughs> it, it's okay, Hanehara. Let it go. I still with you in pursuit of to surpass Okuyama san, no matter how single minded even maniacal things got. I know you do anything to achieve that, but mm -hmm. it's time to let it go. I don't want to see you suffer anymore. Let the weight fall off your shoulders, and let's walk out of this. Are you okay with that? Chica. Is he? Huh? Don't you mess with me. No, he's a fucking asshole through and through. Huh? I see why I lost now. It was you, Chica. You were slacking and you didn't do your job. I would never... It was you and not me. I did nothing wrong. I let you be with me because I thought you'd be useful. And this is how you repay me? I don't need you anymore. He's a fucking narcissistic asshole. Huh? Get the hell out of here. I never want to see your face again. How could you? No. This is so wrong. Chica did her best for you. Huh? Shut the... Shut it the hell up. You don't know shit. This can't be the end of the line for me. How could you possibly understand the pressure I'm under? Majima, I won't take this line down. Come out and fight me. <laughs> Ugly man to the bitter end. Shut the hell up. I don't care about that any anyone thinks of me. Nobody's gonna stop me. Huh? You're mine, Majima. Fine. But when I win, I'm gonna give Yuki back. Well, we're actually gonna fight him. Flabina's Kanehara. Let's beat him up. Eat that, bitch. I'm gonna make sure your face is not recognizable anymore. Eat this, bitch. I hope you lost your teeth. Yeah, I need to ruin his face, so he never comes fucking back. Ow. You actually got a punch in? Let's do breaker style. Get super armor. Okay, this is not working. Let's go thug for a bit. You know what? Eat sword, bitch. Cut you up. Alright, new sword, maybe. Spicy knife. Let's do it. Ah, dang it. I'm better off with the bat for now. If I want to use the knife on him. Oh, he's on fire. Is that really what the spicy knife does? Yeah. You won't be able to jack off anymore, dude. Get good. Oh, 
Top stun. Now pick up this box. Let's finish it off with this. Eat box, bitch. Perfect. How could I go down to a bunch of losers like you? This can't be happening. You're training everyone like your personal pawns. You call us losers? Huh? Wow, he stood up really fast. I want to accept that. We demand we do it over. How pathetic, Kanehara. And that lady's like, hmm, I don't want to get involved in this. Sugiyama, son. <sighs> The thing that a pitiful wretch like you was once considered number two among the five stars. I suggest you remove yourself before you cause me any further embarrassment. Tsukiyama-san, I only wanted to surpass you. Never in a million years. Now, not another word. You are useless, and I want you out of my sight. If you don't, I can make some ar arrangements. <laughs> Shit! Shit! Tsukuyama. It's been a while, Majima-san. My humble apologies if my inept minion actually managed to cause you trouble. <sighs> it was your crew, wasn't he? You wanna call yourself the boss, then you failed just as hard. <laughs> what can I say? I'm embarrassed. In any event, defeating Clubinus, that's quite a feat, Majima-san. Though, I expected nothing less from the manager of the Cabaret Grand. <laughs> I'm real honored. First it was Hino, and now Kanehara. I'd say the five stars aren't twinkling so bright anymore. <laughs> to be frank, I hardly cared about the five stars. If it goes bust, it's really, truly a non-issue. Kanehara, in particular, became quite conceited after he got a little power of money. I knew I could have, I would have got, uh, I knew I would have to get rid of him at some point. <laughs> and he did just that for me, Majima-san. I can't thank you enough. But sooner or later, I may have to step in and fight with you myself. Call it a gut feeling. It's mutual. <laughs> I look forward to the day then, that I can personally put an end to you along with Club Sunshine and Cabaret Grand. Farewell. Looks like we're up against Sukuyama soon. Majima-san. Ah. Yo, Chika-chan. Um. I'm really sorry about Kanehara. Chika-chan. Uh. Never mind that. Ain't no need for you to apologize, but you okay, Chika-chan? <sighs> Not really, I guess. I didn't think he'd say something like that to me. The club's probably gonna shut down too. What am I gonna do? You're joining our fucking club, that's what. You wanna? Why don't you come work with us? <gasps> what? We don't got Kanehara, so you wouldn't be working with your boyfriend anymore. And like Kanehara said, compared to Venus, Club Sunshine looks a little seedy. The girl and the owner are a pretty weird bunch, too, and coming from me, well, that's saying something. But you know, Club Sunshine just the way it is. Working here puts a smile on my face. Maybe you come aboard? You'll find yourself smiling more than you did at the old club, too. I could work with a smile. Huh. Yeah, maybe tear are a woman's weapons sometimes, but I say a smile packs a lot more heat. Come to think of it, I don't think I've smiled in a while. Work, love, both of those should have been a lot more fun. Somewhere along the line, I lost all of that. Chika-chan, you're Club Sunshine's Koromajima, right? I look forward to working with you. Yeah, yeah for sure. Hey. Thank you. I'm smiling. That's neat. And would you look at that? You just smile, and it's like the sun just bursting through the clouds. You really think so? That makes me so happy. Uh, right. Leave the charm on the customers just like that. Guess all ends, all swell that ends well. Have to celebrate our victory. Good call. You guys did a great job today. Let's pop a, some corks. Where's Yuki though? You're gonna save her? Uh. Are we forgetting something? Eh, could have been important. No, Yuki. You've been sitting there for weeks. Help! Yuki has returned safely, even though we never noticed her and she's just chilling on the rooftop. 
More blocks have been unlocked for slugger style. We also got a billion yen. <laughs> so Yama's Club Moon is the only club remaining. Club Moon already says, always says the bar, and I imagine we'd be on the same level as they, them, much less have a shot at winning. Hi. Let's take the fight to Club Moon. We can start buying and also challenging Club Moon area. Well, with that, uh, next episode, we're not gonna go strictly just into Club Moon. I'm gonna focus on doing the special training with the three girls I have on the side right now, which is... Hibiki, Hibichi, Yak, uh, Saki, and Chika. So also we're gonna slowly buy club uh, partnerships, and if we get some club events for Club Moon, we'll do that as well. But I don't, I don't plan on doing Club Moon next episode. We're gonna do some story stuff. And with that, we're gonna call it an episode. Thanks for watching, guys, and hopefully the next episode we'll do more story stuff, so it's not all the game. Anyways, guys, I'll see you then. Bye.